What is going on guys? My name is Roman back again from Roman Reviews here with another episode reaction to Demon Slayer. I am a little bit late to this. Uh, well, in terms of like, you know, I normally get this out around like 11 Pacific Standard Time, but it is about 3 o'clock. Actually, it's 3.30. The main reason why is I worked a 10 hour, 10, almost a 10 hour and a half hour shift. So I basically came home super tired and I basically went home, took a nap, woke up, uh, had some people over. And then I was like, I'm going to go knock out some videos because I got to be up later on tonight to celebrate a friend's birthday party and then go right to work. So I'm 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 kind of busy right now, <laughs> despite, you know, uh, uh, normally being able to just like do other stuff. You now I've been kind of busy lately. Life is more important than <laughs> than uh, anime, unfortunately, right as of right now. But um, but yeah, last episode we got to basically see um, Zenetsu in action. Hold on, I think Zenetsu was the guy with the yellow hair, right? I just want to make sure, right? Yeah, yeah. Zenetsu was um was the one that I felt like. They really made him be portrayed as, like, a character, like, you wanted to be annoyed at. I feel like that was the goal of the anime, and it definitely, it definitely worked. Because, honestly, like, anytime I, see, so I saw him on screen, it was one of those, like, almost cringy moments. But I, I knew that that was part of the course and part of the core. So I actually didn't mind it too much. The one thing I was really interested in is this board guy who was coming up. And I'm really interested in seeing what his whole, his whole ideal, um, ordeal is. Apologize. Because he has those badass blades, and in fact, you can actually see him in this little thumbnail. In fact, hold on, let me hide this really quickly. Um, yeah, you can see it. I mean, I have my logo there also. But yeah, um, I I'm like legitimately like curious of what this guy is. But yeah, this is going to be episode 12. The boar bears its fangs and Zenetsu sleeps. Apparently, we get a really cool scene with Zenetsu later on. Uh, so I'm looking forward to that. Maybe uh, get get into some good graces. Um with his personality because his personality did leave a lot to be wanted if i do say so myself but anyways guys i'm really looking forward to this uh episode this has been by far my favorite episode uh, my favorite season uh, show from this season by far this has been an absolute fun and thrill to be a part of uh just watching this but yeah, I'm ready to jump into the next episode. I'm really hoping this gets a dub, though, so I can actually show my roommates and rewatch it again. Although, granted, I have rewatched this a couple times, which is odd. I've never actually done this for a video series whatsoever uh, in that I've reacted to in a long, long time. I think the last time I actually did that was maybe a like I, it was a couple episodes of Kakigurui. Uh, but although Kakigurui is something I can just constantly just rewatch over and over and over again. Um, I've actually rewatched it twice, <laughs> once on my own and then once with uh, my roommate, and we were just like talking about all the crazy stuff but that's not neither here nor there we're gonna be talking about demon slayer but yeah i'm really hoping that we actually get a dub i don't know i forgot actually oh let me look really quickly i forgot who the production is um demon slayer oops i, I should probably help if you know i actually spell this right demon slayer uh I, it should have it on my anime list but it's not showing up uh because my anime list would be the one there it is my anime list i just want to see who the production is Oh, it's Aniplex? Ooh. Yeah, that's a little bit... They're a little bit known to be a little bit harder to get um, dubs out. Uh, especially with, I think, um, Kaguya-sama Love is War is the same way. Because I think that also um, Aniplex, if I'm... Yep, they are Aniplex, I thought so. Um, so that's the main reason why it, it's a little bit harder to get... Um, Probably dubs. But yeah, anyways, I've been going on. I've been rambling for about four minutes. So without further ado, let us jump in to episode 12 of Demon Slayer or Kimetsu no Yaiba Sun in 3, 2, 1. Let's jam. I'm gonna like you. I'm gonna like you. I think he's meant to be reckless, though, which is good, though, because if you think about it, like, for, like, people who, have, like, have more of an established background in terms of, like, fighting styles, it's gonna throw them off. For example, I think the perfect analogy I can come up with is maybe Mugen from Samurai Shampoo, um, and as I said, Shampoo for a reason, Podtaku, um, but Mugen was the same way, where he, his style was so, 
Although, granted, his was more unique rather than reckless because he would always take a bunch of things from other people's um, fighting styles and incorporate it into his own. But if he was reckless, he's not going to like go into like the whole like looking at it in like a smart point of view. So we'll see. Okay, so who was best girl of the season? Like, I'm really curious. Like, I know, the, I think the most popular is probably Nezuko. I think Nezuko is most popular girl of the season. And she, good reason. She's both a comic relief and, like... And she's, like, it's fun to always see her on screen. Whether when she's fighting or um, other stuff. I'm glad that I got my co-worker into the show, though. Like, I can't wait to see him next time after he's seen this episode. Because me and him usually talk about um, S.H.I.E.L.D. Hero in this. I think the thing that I also I thoroughly enjoy is like how different all of these... Oh, don't step on the little girl! I think he shouldn't be fight. I think he's just in. He is, I think he's just in for the thrill. I mean, that's usually how swords work. But no, like I was saying, I was like the the fa all these different demons' powers and how unique they are from one another. I love it, absolutely great. But he, yeah, but Tanjiro was at a huge disadvantage. But I think he's starting to pick it up. He's starting to pick up on some of the different um, some of the different things. Maybe it's just... Oh, that's what I was thinking. Because you heard that in the background. Well, I know you guys can't if you're watching this video. But um, there was... A, you could hear one in the background. So maybe there's multiple... De there is multiple demons, but maybe they're fighting someone else. Still trying to figure out why her eyes are like that. Her irises. It's almost like they don't have life in them. See, they don't have the she 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 doesn't have the white iris, so it's one of those like it makes it slightly off putting. Why? But why? All right, Zanette. So I know you you like you you actually like um. I know you actually get better later on. No, I was thinking the really signal to you.
No. I have a drinking problem, apparently. That lab suit looked pretty damn creepy. That was pretty good. <sighs> what that tongue do though? I was actually kidding about what that tongue do, but... I am liking how like some of the designs of these uh, demons are starting to change more and more. To be almost... Like, that guy looks grotesque. If it continues with that, that I'm perfectly fine with that. That's when you step up. No, I don't. I don't think he. I think it's gonna. He's 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 gonna get pushed to a point, and then he's actually gonna snap and be like, "Okay, now I actually have to." I think it's. I wonder if it's a front. I don't think so. Actually, I think it like it, he, he could, like once he gets into that mindset, but only when he gets into that mindset when he actually becomes. A, oh, that's creepy. Um, when he gets into that mindset, when he can actually like. Actually, be serious. How the fuck? I thought he might have fainted. He's gonna come in clutch, though. It's. It... Okay, I'm, I was waiting. I've been waiting for this. Yeah, he's like actually nervous. <laughs> now, if he could stay like this most of the entire show, I'd be fine with this. If so, he does it when he's like in a state of unconscious, like not pure consciousness. I this makes me want to like. I really hope they explore. That is my exact reaction. <laughs> But this makes me want to explore more of him. Like, why he's like that. Maybe he can't... Mm, I don't know. Maybe he doesn't actually know he has that power in him. What if he has a split personality? That would be... I, I, that would actually be really cool. I'm not, but it doesn't look like that. Like he only brought up that personality when he lost con. Well, when he didn't have control of his consciousness when he was asleep. Is 
that the big boy? That's a big boy. But if you think about it, that's bigger. That's more. That's more of a target. Self-taught. I just realized he had his. He has his blades wrapped. Now it's not wrapped. Holy shit, there was no challenge. He literally just walked through him. Oh my god. How many are there? Alright, so two are dead. We got this big ass. Oh, fuck. He, he's an ex-member of the 12. Actually, that, that would have been a perfect thing to end the... Um... Uh. I have a feeling maybe just a shot in the dark, maybe one of the twelves have infiltrated one of the demons um demon uh infiltrated the demon slayer corpse. Just a shot in the dark, I might be completely wrong. I don't know. But why was he hitting that? Why was he hitting the thing? Was that? Oh, ointment. I thought it was food for. It might have been food. You know what? This actually reminds me a little bit of like. Oh shoot! What was? I can't think of it. Um, a little bit of Soul Eater when it cut how it changes that our animation. I mean, Soul Eater is a lot more lighthearted than this, but still. It's so trying to compare it to, like, a Shonen. I wasn't going to say a Hulk's Ultimate, because that's too drastic of a difference. But how'd you get away? Oh, is it the... Oh. They're all fighting him. Oh. Well, okay, so it looks like there's only three for the most part. Oh, he ripped one of them out. Oh, that's why he hit it. Kind of to escape. Okay, that makes sense. What is Merici? Okay then, thank you. Thanks, Crow. Appreciate it. Kind of like how A, B...
isn't like AB negative like the I, I think it was like AB negative was like the um That's the only thing I can maybe compare it to. Are we actually going to wrap this up by this episode? That's so cool! But he's gonna... So... Oh, this is so cool! Look at this! <laughs> I'm sorry, every time I see Nezuko. I keep on forgetting that Nezuko's left outside. He has high his pain. Yeah, he is still like he's still damaged. He can't even see. Ah. Uh. So how is it going to work on this ideal uh, ordeal? We've seen a good amount of them. To form to fight anything that to come across. Sorry I'm not reacting much, but I'm like, I'm like, totally engrossed in this right now.
It's gonna end here. Yeah, I had a feeling. Okay, so we're not. Okay, next episode we're gonna wrap this up. That's. Oh, this show is too good. Why is this show so good? Like, yeah, this show has already by far ex exceeded my expectations, and so far has blown Shield Hero out of the water, because it hasn't dropped in terms of consistency in terms of my enjoyment i've like in fact it's just continued to get bigger and bigger and more of like i want to know more about this whole like the whole lore about all of this that's one thing i can definitely say that i've been thoroughly enjoying much more than shield Hero because shield hero had these moments where it just i know i shouldn't be comparing but it's one of the few other shows that i'm reacting to i'm only reacting to three shows this season so let me compare it's my channel damn it <laughs> but yeah shield hero you can tell that there are some things kind of missing in terms of the... Like, you, there are some things that are lost in translation, especially in this show. You can just tell. Even though I've never seen or read the original source material, you can just tell. This one, I'm not in the dark on anything so far. From what this... Like, from this... It doesn't... From what I've seen so far, there isn't any questions that are not left unanswered... That hasn't been explored yet, if you know what I mean. Like, it kind of seems like Shield Hero kind of glosses over things. This one doesn't, like, it's one of those, like, oh, we'll show you things, so you're going to have a question, but we'll we'll talk about it later on. Like, Zenetsu, I'm, I'm almost positive we're going to get more information on to why he is the way he is. By the way, for people who are the manga readers, those backgrounds, are they actually in the, are, or is that, like, straight from the manga? Like, that's straight from the manga. If that is, that's, love that touch. You know, despite despite I think this is one of the first few times outside of the training regiment where Nezuko is like not involved. Yeah, that's actually the truth. But anyways, guys, I thoroughly enjoyed this episode. We finally got his Zenetsu pop off. It's one little slash. But we got to see it, and I want to. I want to know why that is, and I know eventually we're gonna get more details about that, and I'm lo really looking forward to that. And I want to know more about the support guy. I I know someone like had posted um in some videos like the name of him, but I've forgotten all honesty. Um, but like I, I I'm thoroughly enjoying his character. I want to know why he is the way he is, but he's a beast. Hence the you know the 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 mask and all that stuff, but. I wouldn't, I, like, there's so much lore behind everything that I'm just, like, thoroughly enjoying it. Like, I didn't know you can just get kicked out of the the, the 12. Um, and, yeah, and, I, like, I have no idea how much they're going to be able to, like, fit into this. Because I know that this is going to be a two-core, um, although I don't know if the second core means there's going to be continuation after 24. Or 25, however many episodes. But I do plan to continue watching the show, regardless. I mean, I'm already started on it. So it's one of those things, like... I mean, I knew Shield Hero was going to be longer, so I, was, I, I, I was dedicated to this. But this show, like, I thoroughly enjoy looking... Like, I, I thoroughly enjoy the show. I look forward to it every single week. Way more... This is the most anticipated show that I'm looking forward to, like, in terms of, like, what I'm watching. Outside of Neo Genesis Evangelion on Netflix, but that's besides the point. But... Or Evangelion. Don't shoot me pronunciation, please. Um, but yeah. Pronunciation, please. Not punctuation, but whatever. Anyways, guys. What did you guys think about this episode? By far, this show is, like, shaping up to be my favorite show. Okay, please. Do not drop this quality. If you don't drop this quality, this will be one of my favorite shonens in recent in recent years. And that's saying something. Don't I don't hold a lot of shonens up in my top tier list. Very few of them, and the few that are top tier is usually considered wide, low, um, far and wide as some of the best ones, like Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood, Soul Eater, Hell, just some, just like the amount of shonens and uh, the amount of shows in the shonen genre is huge, but this one has yet to like disappointment in any way. Like, Zenetsu was just, like, the worst part I've ever experienced is the fact that Zenetsu was annoying. But I knew that was part of the course. So I got, I, I, I went along with it. And that was my least favorite part so far. 
the first one, the, my second least favorite part was probably like I wish they could hit more emotional impact with the first episode. But after watching this now, I'm fine with it because we're getting more emotional. Like, hey, that was just kind of like a buildup. This was just like a little bit of a snippet. It wasn't meant to be like so super emotional. I mean, it might have been, but like they're not. It, it's not showing, and I think that's part. Uh, I think uh, like I'm giving them the. I'm 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 assuming that's what the point is. But yeah. But anyways, guys. Yeah, thoroughly enjoyed this episode. Oh shit, this has been on going on for about half an hour. I'm, I'm normally wrap this up, but I just had a lot to say about this show. I, I like I said, I thoroughly enjoy the show. I, I I love it. I'm I'm thoroughly enjoying it, and I'm hoping it continues to be like this. And like I said, if it continues to be this way all the way up till the end, it's probably gonna reach in my top. It's gonna reach into my top five of best shonens. But I I know the sh the series is still going on, so we're not gonna ex I'm not gonna be expecting an ending anytime soon, because it's usually how it goes. But we'll see what happens. Anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys soon for Boku Ben or We Never Learn. Right after this, I'm gonna go hurry up and upload this, then start working on it. So yeah, we're gonna be seeing. Um, you're gonna be seeing me really soon. But yeah, anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed my reaction. And as always, thank you so much. And I'll see you guys in the next video. See ya.